Hey, this is Troy from Cube Dweller Fitness. And one of the things I want to talk about today is hydration. I know there's lots of different guidelines and lots of different science that has looked at how much water we should have and how much is too much. And the standards are still all over the map. And so I'm not even going to tell you how much water you should be having or how much is too much. It's something that really depends on your level of activity, where you live, and a whole number of different things. And so whether it's eight ounces, uh, eight ounce, eight, eight ounce glasses of water a day or more or less, it varies. But as I talk to wellness practitioners, one of the patterns that I hear from them consistently is their clients consistently do not consume enough water. So if we should be consuming more water, one of the best ways to do that is find a way that it's easier for us to do that. And for me, that meant tracking down a bottle that I enjoy. And you've probably started to see these around. This is a swell water bottle. And I have to say that when it comes to design, I love this thing. It's a water bottle that I will actually use and keep filled and keep with me. And I've been consuming a lot more water because of it. Um, and so uh, first, a little bit about the bottle. It is, a, I think, a pretty cool design. It's from a company called Swell, where they've taken design to the next level. Not only do they, do they want a water bottle that looks great, but one that battles against all these plastic water bottles showing up all, all over the place. Not only on the impact that ha that has on the planet, but also just the effect that plastic has on us. And so this is a stainless steel water bottle that can keep things cold for up to 24 hours. And I have to say, I've been using mine inside and outside. We live in Colorado, we live in the hot sun, and I've put some cold drinks in here with some ice in it and just some water. And it sits in the sun and there, there's been, been some times, even though this is a light color, the metal has been hot to the touch. I'll grab it and the bottle feels like it's warm. I feel like it's going to be just terrible to drink. Open it up. And what I find is the ice is still in there. That my drink, even though it's outside, in the bottle, the outside of the bottle is hot. The ice often doesn't even melt. And so it does. It stays cold for 24 hours. It says it will keep something hot for 12. I haven't used my for hot liquid. Maybe that's because it's summer right now. Um, but do check out Swell. I have a pattern uh, that is the, the birch bark pattern. So printed on the outside, you can get a number of different colors. Mine looks like it's the bark of a tree, which I think is kind of cool. Uh, but they've got a whole assortment of different colors. I think the next one that I'm going to get is a larger size. And it's that blue, that third one over. Uh, I want something that's a little bit bigger. So we're going on camping trips or longer hikes, I can bring a little more water with. Um, but one of the things that made me think about is how do I carry this around? The last hike I went on, I just carried it and just had it as, as I was walking and ended up finding that I didn't really like that. And so I've looked at that over time and thought of different ways that I could contribute to the Swell community. Or if it's not this brand, although I highly in, enjoy these, if it's another narrow necked water bottle, how can you easily carry those around? We started looking, my wife and I started looking to see if, if there are other people that have solved this problem. And we found there's a gap. And, and so we've been thinking and dreaming just for our own use, what we could do. And at the same time, I signed up for something from Gumroad, which is where I've been selling some of the fitness programs through. They're going through something called the Small Product Lab, where in 10 days you go from crazy idea to something that's shippable. And so in the Small Product Lab from Gumroad, my wife and I decided that we're going to try and create something, a physical product, to help you with your water bottle so it can bring you you can bring it with you easily, carry it with you when your hands are full of other things or carry it with you when you're hiking uh, a little bit easier. And so what we came up with is this concept to go through the small product lab called the Hydro Loop. There's my bottle and all the Hydro Loop does is it adds a loop on the top. And that loop, if you go in a little bit closer, is a nice piece of neoprene. This is just an early prototype that shows you how it attaches. And let me show you. So here's my bottle and here's the hydro loop. Basically it slips right on top and then cinches down tight 
And, you know, if you're hopping in and out of the car, going in and out of the office, going to a meeting, your hands are already full. You can pick it up with a finger. So it's like a finger loop for your bottle. It can stay on there. You can you know, still use the bottle with the hydro loop attached. But also, uh, you can put it on your wrist. And so that way, if you're, you want to walk around with it, you know, again, you can just have the bottle dangle from your arm and bring your water with you. And so watch for this. We're working from July 27th is when the small product lab started. So we're in the small product lab with the Hydro Loop. And that means on August 5th, this thing is going to be available on Gumroad for you to reach out and get. So watch for it on the Hydro Loop at Cube Dweller Fitness. There's a link below. And cheer us on as we go through going from this crazy idea that my wife and I had to make it easier for you to carry your swell water bottle with or any narrow necked water bottle with something called the Hydro Loop. So look forward to our updates. Share this if you will. If you know someone that has these bottles or likes it and, and would appreciate a good way to carry their bottle with them, tell them about the Hydro Loop. And Get connected, sign up so that you'll be the first to know when we do make this available. Again, this is Troy from Cube Dweller Fitness. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.